Hey guys, welcome to the video today. We're here back in the backstage of reality. Now I've learned a little bit about the backstage of reality. Um, I, if you guys remember me reading that thing that said going into the hub, well the hub is very important. Well, it's not, you don't, it's not needed to get through to the levels, but it's very helpful because you can basically skip from level 1 all the way to level 8 in the hub, which is pretty massive. That means that you can just skip, like, through how many levels? I don't even know. You can skip through 8 levels, 7 levels. So that, I, now, and I know how to get to the hub, I know the exact way in this maze how to get to the hub, I actually figured it out, I did not watch a YouTube video for this, I promise I did find this myself, we were surprised, I tried looking for a video on how to beat this level with Malik, um, but then it didn't make any sense to me, and because he just killed himself, and then he just went to a random part in the video where he found the actual exit that leads you to level 2. Well, we're trying to go to the hub, and the way to get to the hub is you gotta go around here, and then you just gotta walk into the wall right here, and you'll get teleported into here. Now, it's very important, now, me and Malik have tested all these doors, now Malik's not with me right now, but we went through this entire, uh, way of going through the hub, so you gotta go to the left one first, so we're gonna go to the left hallway. And if you go to the wrong hallway, then it's going to teleport you out of the hub, and it's going to teleport you back to just the normal spawning point area. It's not going to, like, kill you, it's just going to teleport you out. Like, you're, it, it's just going to, like, your screen's just going to blur for a second, and it's going to go straight back to the normal area. So it's left, and then right. So we're going to take a right. And... Yep, we're gonna go down here. Okay. And then the next one is left. So it's left, right, left. And then, let's go over to here. And by the way, this leads to the hub. I don't know if I mentioned that or not. I probably didn't. Um, but yeah. Um, and then the last hallway would be right. Now, there still is two more hallways that you gotta go through, but they're gonna be labeled A and B. And we know which one to go through, too. So, we're gonna go... So, the pattern is left, right, left, right. And then... They go down to here. Come on. And it is B. So left, right, left, right, B. And then the last one will be A. So it's left, right, left, right, B, A. That is the um, pattern to getting to the hub now, way before you guys try and go to the hub. Um, look, it's not just that, right? So, enigmatic level, the hub. Welcome to the hub. From here, you can travel to level 0 to 3. It is, it's also a great place to meet up with other wanderers. That is true. Now, you're going to see this. So, so now, before any of you guys just try and go to the hub and just go straight to level 8, well, real quick, level 8 is not like what you would think it is. It's not... A, anything like how the backrooms level 8 would actually work. Um, it's basically, it's, um, it's basically what we just did. You have to choose the right path. If you don't, then you die, you go back, and you have to do it again. Now we, now me and Malik, we went through this, 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 and we finally got the right pattern on how to beat level 8. Here we go. Level 8 cave system. This level is a very dangerous cave system. There are a ton of spiders and entities waiting for you. Will you be able to survive? So, that's what the back room's level 8 is. Here, there's no entities in it or at all. You, it, it's what I just said. It's it's basically a bunch, of, a bunch of pathways, and you gotta choose the right pathway. If you don't choose- if you choose the wrong pathway, then it'll lead you to, like, a little river. And then if you go- and then- 
and then, you know, if you touch the river, then you die. So, here we go. So, there's also a flashlight, but it doesn't really work. So, yeah. Um, yeah, it doesn't really work. So, the first one is straight. So, you go straight, and then we're going to go up here. And then the next one is middle. And then the next is middle again, and then left. Uh, I just named it second left, but you can do middle left if you want to to make it a little bit more simpler. Now, you're going to see this maintenance tunnels, right? Now, we got tricked at first. We thought that this meant that you pass the level, but no. The maintenance levels lead you to level 2. Which means you just got bat you just got pushed back all the way six levels. Do not go through the maintenance tunnels. Definitely do not go through the maintenance tunnels. The maintenance tunnels are bad. They lead you straight to level two, and you do not want to do that. Now I know that there's spikes here, but that's actually good. You want to go right. Now the spikes don't actually hurt you, so it's okay if you touch them. Um, I still avoid them anyways, but it doesn't hurt you anyways. Then you're gonna go down the hole that's right here. Um, the hole that's right here in the middle. And then you're going to take another right, um, so, um, well technically I guess you're taking a straight and then a right, but you know what I mean. So then you're going to take a right here. And then watch out because there are rivers on either side of this path. So make sure you do not touch the river because if you touch it then you're going to get respawned all the way back to the beginning. So make sure you don't touch that. Now you're going to be in this cave and you're wanting you're going to want to go this way. And you will see a rope here and you're going to want to climb the rope. Okay. So then once you climb the rope, you're going to want to go in the middle one. And then you're going to want to go left. And then you're going to want to go, oh wait, we're not there yet. And then you're going to want to go right. Um, wait, what? I did I do another one? Okay, I didn't know that. Hold up. I thought that was it. Hold on. Hold on a second. Wait, what? I thought... Thought I wrote down the pattern, but apparently not, whatever. I mean, it seems like I'm not actually dying. There we go. Um, I think I might have done some, I think I might have done it a little wrong. I think I might have went a wrong way, but I'm pretty sure you don't actually die when you're up there. It's, I'm pretty sure it just leads you to like the same levels back and forth. So I don't really think it means anything. Alright, so now, those are the only things that I have patterns on. Um, level 9 suburbs, I don't really know how to do this. So, I think you kind of, you, and I know what you have to do. You have to, you have to find a, um, you have to find a tunnel that you have to go through. Um, so, you will actually see a cave. Then you can go through. Me and Malik went through the cave, us idiots, thinking that it led you to level 11, or to level, yeah, to level 11. No, it, le it led us back to level 8. So, do not go through a cave. There's a difference between a cave and a tunnel. A tunnel is man-made. A cave is just naturally made by Earth. So, if it's made of, like, rocks, and it's all kind of corroded, I guess, not really, it's all, you know, like, you know what I mean, okay? And if it's, if it's, like, nice, smooth concrete, then that's a tunnel. And I'm gonna show you what the tunnel looks like when I find it, and I actually believe it's right down this road. I think it is. Unless, obviously, I'm just going down the wrong road, but I believe the tunnel is actually this way. So, I know that, now, I don't really know where I spawned, because I've never spawned here before when I spawned in... Because uh, I played, obviously I played through the suburbs twice, because me and Malik went through the cave once, and it brought us, yeah, oh my god, I got a lucky spawn, because look, this is a tunnel, 
This is not a cave, this is a tunnel, because it's nice and man-made concrete. So I just got a lucky spawn there, and I just turned around, and boom, I'm going to level 11. Alright, so, here's the thing about level 11, Endless City. So, here's the thing about level 11. I got so upset. When I was going through level 11, I walked into a building, because I could walk through it, I could walk into a building. But... When I walked into it, it spawned me all the way back to level 4. And Malik spawned somewhere else. So that meant that I wasn't even with Malik. I just spawned myself. So Malik was still in level 11. I wasn't. So I, I got so mad that I just, I rage quitted. So I don't know actually where to go in level 11. So we're just going to hope I don't go to a wrong place. If I go to the wrong place, the video ends. And we're just gonna keep doing this pattern until I finally find the right area to go. So, it seems like we can't go into here. Uh, because, I mean, it seems like it's already empty, so there would be no place to go there. You got the Endless City Mall. It says it's under construction. I'm guessing, honestly, it actually probably is under construction. Like, they're actually probably, like, still building it. So I don't know to trust this, man. I don't know if I should trust this, because this, I'm guessing that if you actually walk into there, it'll teleport you somewhere. Because when I went, I think it was actually this building. I think it was this building. When I went into it, it spawned me to level 4. So you gotta be careful with where you go here. So we're trying to look for, like, a tower that I would be able to no-clip through a window. What, like, we gotta look for something that looks special, like this. Like, why are the windows so bright? Maybe this leads you to level 12. Actually, there's a staircase up there. Maybe, if you can get into this building, this will probably lead you to level 12. I'm hoping. And I'm and I, I'm really, like, I really want to see what level 12 is like. Because I want, I'm, really, I'm really curious to see how they made their level 12. Because, like, level 12 is, very, is a very hypothesized level. Like, there's no real kind of evidence about level 12, because the thing about level 12 is that apparently it, it gives, like, a fogginess to everyone's brain whenever they kind of play it, whenever they kind of go through the level. So no one actually really remembers what happens, so there's no real, like, evidence. But it is, like, the most hypothesized thing that's kind of, like, proved is, um, is that it's, like, basically, like, a white room with a table, a chair, and some light. And a door on the other side. And supposedly you're supposed to keep like... I don't actually know. I'm not I'm not going to go over how to exit it. Because there's actually a lot of hypothesized ways about how to exit. And I don't want to... I don't want people being like, no, you're wrong. It's this way. So I don't want that to happen. So unfortunately, I don't think there's a way to get into this. It looks like a very <laughs> special building. Because it definitely looks different from the rest. It doesn't look like a real building. <laughs> but, uh, yeah. And, oh, yeah, and this. Yeah, there's some, like, uh, things that are clipped into each other. We got the ESK laundromat. Um, I don't think you can actually go in there. And I'm not gonna test it. Okay, that probably leaves you to level zero. If you go in there, that probably leads you to level zero, because I can kind of... That looks like it. So, you can kind of infer, like, if I went through here, where would this lead me? Like, where would this lead me? Would this lead me to level 12? Probably not. Would this lead me to level 4? Also, probably not, because level 4 doesn't really have these type of walls and stuff. I would say that some of these would probably lead me to level 13, but, but they don't have level 13 into this game yet. You know what? I think I'm gonna take a risk. I think I'm gonna take a risk, and if it doesn't work, then you'll see me back in two days attempting it again. Let's do it. Three, two, one. Okay, you can't go into that. Okay. I don't know if I should be happy by that or sad by that. Uh, not really any. Um, oh man, where, where would this lead me? That would probably lead me like level 3 or 2 or something. Looks like a dark area that I probably don't want to go into. Um. Man, what is that sound? 
I really don't know where to go. Like, I'm afraid that I'm gonna go into a wrong area. What is this guy doing? We got Bean Man over here. Alright, let's go over here. No, that, yeah, that was definitely the building that I walked into that made me go to level 4. That, I'm pretty sure that was the building. It definitely looked like that. It, it seems like they have multiple of these, so that's interesting. Food land! Food land! Yay! That probably does not lead to level 12. Alright, uh... I don't know, let's go to this one. Oh, you know, I was just at that. Uh... Man, dude, I don't really know. Like, I'm... I guess I really should... Okay. Well, we... It's definitely not that. It's definitely not that. That definitely leads you to level zero. 100%. It will not lead to anything but level zero. If it leads you to level 12, I will be the most surprised I've ever been. Party and goer. Laundromat. Okay. <laughs> That's interesting. Um. Alright, come on, man. We gotta find the exit here. Yeah, I'm definitely not going through there. That is gonna definitely lead me to level zero. I mean, although on the other hand, if you guys want this video to be long, and that leads me to level zero, I could just go to the hub again, and just do it again. But, I'm not gonna test it. There's Bean Man again. Seems like he's still kinda stuck, so I guess we'll go this way. Alright, let's try this. We're trying this building. I'm, I'm gonna try this building. I'm gonna try it. I'm ready. Ready? Three, two, one, go. I can't. You can, You also cannot go into this building. Okay. Um. I don't. Is there a way to go into the Endless City Mall? Can we go in here? Even though this is under construction? No. Um. Dude, I don't, I don't freaking know, man. Wouldn't it be in, like, a different type of, like, building that you only see once in the level? No. Okay. <laughs> um. Because I was thinking, like, because, like, are they going to have, like, multiple buildings that are the same that would lead you to level 12? Like, I wouldn't think that. Oh, by the way, update on my, um, my Minecraft and Backrooms, I've been, I've been grinding on it. We're already up to, like, level 13 in that already. And it's only been about a day. Or, like, uh, two days. Hopefully this leads me to level 12. I'm going up a parking garage now. I'm hoping I can jump out of the windows if I, if it, if it doesn't lead to anything. Because I don't really feel like walking down all this. I mean, you can jump, so I think that's a good sign, but I don't know if it's, like, the windows are gonna be, like, invisible blocked. Okay, how big is this parking garage? I'm probably going up this for nothing. Or maybe they're trying to make you think that. And then it secretly leads you to level 12. See, you didn't think about that. Big brain. Oh, there's another parking garage, though. That's probably a bad sign. That probably means it leads to nothing. Yay! I'm wasting my time climbing up a parking garage. <laughs> well, maybe I'm not, though. Maybe I'm not. Maybe I'm not. Oh, you know, have faith. Have faith. I just wasted my time climbing up a parking garage. <laughs> oh, man. Alright, please let me jump off of the top of it. Please. I really don't feel like walking down the entire thing. Yeah. Oh, yes, I can. Okay, and I don't die. Yay. I saw something. What's that? Is that level 12? <laughs> the city hotel? No, that definitely leads you to... That 100% leads you to the hotel, which would be... Which is level 5. And it's literally... It's literally called hotel. So, I think they're... They're basically just screaming it at you to not go through that. So, we're definitely not going to that. Oh, man. I don't freaking... No, let's see if I can go in through here. Dude, I, I really don't... I don't know. I feel like I've tried every building that I know 
like that I know doesn't lead to anything bad. See, I know that this building, this, these type of buildings that you see here, these lead you to level 4. And I know that for a fact, because it happened to me. This, I'm almost 100% sure that leads you to level 5. Because, I mean, it literally says hotel, and I like, and like, level 5 of the back rooms is literally called the hotel, or terror hotel, I don't know, people... Everyone calls it different things. It's basically the same thing, though. It's a hotel, okay? That, that That's what it's saying. <sighs> I have a feeling I'll never find an exit, dude. I don't... I don't... Like... Where... Where does this game want me to go? I don't see anywhere else I can go. You want me to go into the freaking P&W laundromat? Here, fine, I'll go into the P&W laundromat. Oh, no, I can't. <laughs> um, okay. What is this, like a soccer field? I'm guessing. With no goals? Uh, dude, what? Like, this video is going to end up being 30 minutes because I can't find an exit. <laughs> I, I've never tried these ones. I've ne yeah, I never tried these ones. So level, remember, level twelve is supposedly a like a, just a bunch of white rooms that you just endlessly go through and through and through. So maybe this, maybe this is, maybe maybe this would lead to level twelve. Probably not. Did I say level two? I might have said level two on accident earlier a second ago. Well, there's literally no, there's literally nowhere to go in this. So that's definitely not. Any building that you can actually walk into is probably, like, is not gonna lead you anywhere. Alright, we're gonna go to this blue house. It says something on the door, so... Let's see. This place is so peaceful. I can't go through the blue house either. Oh, come on. Where does this game want me to go? Do I really just go through the hotel? I mean, I've never went to the hotel, so... Maybe that's where you're actually supposed to go? Like, I don't... I just don't think that, though. Can we go in... No, I already tried going to that, uh, yet, or two days ago. Yeah. That doesn't lead you anywhere. I don't know, I guess... Uh, like, I guess I go into the hotel, like... But it's gonna take me to level 5, like... Where else is it going to take me? It's not going to take me to level 12. Like, I don't think that's going to happen. If you guys know what building really leads you to level 12, please let me know. Alright, I guess we're going to do it. I mean, there's nowhere else for me to go. Like, do you want me to... Here, well, let's try whatever building's over here. And then, if it doesn't let you go into it, or if it doesn't do anything... Then I guess the video will end because I don't want this video to be too long. But yeah, why can I? Okay, my video is lagging, or not my video, my game is lagging. Uh, that just looks like a normal, nice building. Oh uh, wait, no, that's one of those buildings again. Can I enter on this side? this whoa whoa what is this I don't think I'm supposed to be here uh does this do anything can I no clip through one of these walls you can send to level 12 anyone please uh no I don't think this is supposed to be here though <laughs> Alright, well, I guess, I guess let's try and go through the, uh, city hotel and see where that leads us. And, uh, I'm- my guess is that it leads us to level 5, and if it really does lead us to level 5, I have no idea where to go. Maybe we have to go in the forest, maybe we have to go into the trees, and it- the trees maybe lead us to a building, maybe? I don't know, let's see, but let's go into the hotel right now. Let me guess, level 5? 
You can't even go into the hotel. Okay, then. Well, I guess I'm gonna leave this- I guess I'm gonna leave this video here, then. Like, I- I don't- I don't know where to go. I mean, they supposedly have a level 12, so there has to be an exit. Right? There has to be an exit. I don't know, man. There has to be an exit. There has to be. Because they, if they have a level 12, there has to be an exit. And then level 12, I guess they just say, like, obviously, you know, like, there's no level 13. So it'd probably, like, bring you back to the hub or something. But, uh, I don't know, man. I really don't freaking know. I guess I'm going to leave this video here, guys. If you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to hit the like button and subscribe to see more of my videos. Hit the notification bell so you never miss any of my future videos because I'm posting videos like this every single day. But as always, guys, thanks so much for watching this video. Click the right video for the previous video. Click the left video for the video that YouTube recommends uh, personally to you that's from me. But as always, guys, thanks so much for watching. And, um, yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. And again, um, if you know where I'm supposed to go to beat level 11... Uh, I would appreciate it in the comments, uh, but if you don't, I guess that's fine, because I'll probably just end up looking it up anyways, but, yeah, <laughs> yeah, I guess. Is that a building back here? Wait a minute, hold up. I was about to end my video, but, is this a building? Oh, never mind, that's not a building. <laughs> okay, well, end the video. <laughs>